Uiti. Gavana wa kaunti ya Kirinyaga Anu Waiguru ametangaza kuondoka rasmi katika mrengo wa Rais Uhuru Kenyatta kwenye chama cha Jubili na kujiunga na naibu Rais William Ruto katika chama chake cha UDA. Waiguru aliendamana na wawakilishi wa ADI 23 kujiunga na UDA na kukaribishwa rasmi na naibu Rais mwenyewe katika hafla iliyoandaliwa katika makazi yake ya Karen jijini Nairobi. Mna habari wetu Duncan Haimba ana taarifa hiyo kwa kina. You know, the masterminds cannot be walking around doing cut work on us when public money has been lost, giving us long lectures. Wagomba nao, ndiyo wapata nao. Msemo humo onekana kudhihirika katika uhusiano wa naibu rais William Ruto na gavana wa county ya Kirinyaga Anu Waiguru. November mwakalfu mbili na kuminasita, uhasama wa kisiasa uliibuka kati ya Waiguru enzi hizo akiwa waziri wa ugatuzi na naibu rais William Ruto. Ruto akimtaka Waiguru kuwajibikia wizi wa takriban shilingi milioni 1791 kwenye sakata ya fedha za huduma ya vijana wa taifa NYS. Kama wanavyosema wanasiasa wenyewe katika siasa hakuna maadui wa kudumu. Tarehe 26 Oktoba mwaka 2021 siku ya kuzaliwa kwa kinara wa chama cha Jubilee Rais Uhuru Kenyatta, gavana wa pekee wa kike chamani Ann Mumbi Waiguru ameitaliki kambi hiyo ya rais Kenyatta na kujiunga na chama cha UDA chake naibu rais William Ruto. Tulikuwa tumekuja hapa kufanya tu kitu moja na ni kuvuka. Chama ni UDA na form ni <laughs> na mpango ni bottom up. As you have said you have been waiting for this moment. I have also told you even on this other side we have also been waiting for this moment. <laughs> because we all knew it is going to happen <laughs> when was the problem hata hivyo hatua ya waiguru kuhamia UDA inazua kizungumkuti kwa Ruto kuhusu jinsi atakavyosawazisha mambo baina ya dada hao wawili wa Kirinyaga ambao wamekuwa na uhusiano wa paka na panya na wote wanawinda kiti cha ugavana kwa upande mmoja mwakilishi wa kike Purity Wangoi Ngirishi ameganda na Ruto kwa muda mrefu licha ya mawimbi makali ya kisiasa. Ngirishi ambaye hakuhudhuria hafla hiyo ya kumkaribisha Waiguru alikuwa na machache ya kusema akionekana kuridhia hatua hiyo. She's very welcome. Because we need everyone on board. Without competition, how do you know your strength? But well, I already have my strength as the crown. I know the people are with me and I know nothing is going to change because who is she going to get if I already had people. The Bible says that when you lack wisdom, you ask for it. James 1:5. And I have asked for wisdom. And I think I have listened. Many people would rather make peace with mediocrity rather than be bold and make the decision that uh, will shape the future. Wadadisi wanasema huenda hatua ya Waiguru ni mbinu ya kukimbilia usalama wa kisiasa anapojiandaa kuhifadhi kiti chake cha ugavana mwaka ujao kwani mbwa hafi maji aonapo ufukwe Is it betrayal if I moved message that I have been given by everybody I have talked to is that in politics you must be very careful to stay relevant lakini kilicho bayana sasa ni kwamba gavana wa iguru mwandani wa rais uhuru kenyata kutoroka jubilee kunazidi kuibua maswali kuhusiana na mstakabala wa chama hicho duncan haemba ktn news na mtazamaji mahakama ya nyuki inatarajiwa kutoa uamuzi katika kesi ambayo jamii ya eneo la loldaiga 